Here's a tool called Vocaroo. It's really awesome even for the youngest students because it's so simple to use. All the students need to do is click on the red button and record their voice. Okay, you'll get a message asking you to allow access to the microphone and you just click allow. And now it's recording my voice. So all I do is sit closely to the laptop and I speak into it and students could possibly have a script beside them, some point form notes, or even some pictures. Maybe it's they're describing a picture that they've drawn if they're young students or even older students, just to keep them on focus, and then they stop when they're finished. So you could listen to your message. I won't bother to do that, but have a look at what the options are. So if we click here to save, you could, if you happen to have a blog, you could embed the voice into a blog or a wiki or so on, but to me this is one of the most exciting features that I've found. This is called a QR code. I'm going to click on this link and then I'll show you what it looks like. So here in the top left corner is the QR code. You've seen them on products of all kinds in magazines and newspapers. So what you would do then is have a student create an auditory message. You could print out this QR code and let's say maybe they were talking about a book they read. You could attach it to the inside cover of the book, for example. Or maybe you were going on a scavenger hunt and you could place these QR codes around the school and basically what happens is a student would need to take a handheld device with a QR code reader and scan this code and then they would hear that recording that you made or that the students made. Okay, this would be an awesome tool to use.